Okay, and we're back. I went ahead and did all of my, um, leveling up and healing and stuff off camera because I can. And it's a little bit easier to do it like that because I can think and minimize, min-max? Minimize? Anyway, I made Natalia good at hitting things with her fists. And I think I might want to go down that, like, place that blew up after the pod blew up. I also- I forgot how many goopy goos I needed to, like, do the thing, so I'm just gonna collect all of them. Go away, Sergio! Ooh, I like that. Go away, Sergio! Nah, Sergio's dead. Nice, got an upgrade. I mean, don't have any ammo, but it's an upgrade. <laughs> Hopefully I'll find some, or somebody's holding it. I don't know. Nope, don't have any ammo for anything. Go away, Sergio. Calm down, friend. This man smells of booze and sadness. You ain't Sergio no more. Please, don't make me shoot you. Don't make me do to you what I had to... to. <laughs> We're the Rangers. Rangers? You bastards, what took you so long? Hang on, I'll unbar the door. Fun oh yeah, so... I got the, uh, the thing to do the stuff to the plants. A book that I'm not gonna read because who reads books? Okay, okay, you're still people. So what are you doing here? You come to save the day? Well, you're too late. Why'd you say we're too late? Maybe if you would have come earlier, I wouldn't have had to kill my wife. What the hell took you so long? Always happy to see the rangers come around. Yep. Matt was a ranger once. Did you know that? Who was Sergio? My son. He was with his mama in the field when everything went insane. I guess he must have caught the sickness somehow. Because when he came home with Marta, so glad the blast that killed Marta scared him off. I couldn't bear to kill my wife and my son in the same day. We clear the path. You can escape. Thanks, but I don't know if I'm ready to go. Don't want to see any ghosts. We mean by ghosts. What else would you call dead people you knew and loved who are still up and walking around? I killed one already. I don't want to kill no more. You mean you killed the woman out there? My, my wife Marta, she and my son Sergio were out in the fields when the madness started. They found me all right. When did the madness start? I started seeing it in the mushroom case about an hour ago. The mushrooms growing out of control, the other guys getting sick, acting funny, then the alarm started going off. I tried to head upstairs to find Marta and Sergio, but Doug from engineering and a few of the others chased me in here and tried to tear my face off. And then, then Marta and Sergio, I found out somebody sabotaged us. I'd, I'd kill him. Alright, uh, I'm done talking to this guy. <laughs> There's gonna be like ten more paragraphs of dialogue, but what he's yeah, the gist of it is, somebody probably betrayed the people at the Ag Center, and stuff is going down. But I, I, I like to listen to all the dialogue, but I don't want to literally sit there for half an hour listening to all of it because that would be the length of the entire video if I did that. Kill them plants. Oh. Kick that door. <laughs> Explode that mine. Okay, you can computer hack that safe. Some you can kick open the or you can not computer hack the safe. And completely ruin it. 
That works too. Alright, what's in the box? Ooh, alrighty. Who was I gonna give it a Natalia has punching things. I don't have a secondary thing yet. So hmm, what are my skills like? Only good with handguns, so I think I'm gonna save that submachine gun for somebody who might join the party later. And give the assault rifle to me. Not much else to do here, I don't think. Is that guy with me? Is he somewhere else? Alright, so I'm gonna make my way out of the cave because I got all the uh, bits and bobs to kill the death plants. Death kill the dead plants? Dead the death? Death? <laughs> Pretend these are words. Oh no, the man is stuck in plant. After we get you out, we will have many vodka. I have two vodka right now. See, what I was hoping would happen to make that joke a little bit funnier. Uh, say that man tied up in those vines got, you know, death exploded by plants. I mean, that wouldn't be good. I'd be missing out on some XP, but, you know. Alrighty. <laughs> I've given up trying to just take the plants out slowly and try not to take damage. It doesn't matter. I mean, I'm saying it's only three damage, but, you know, five minutes from now, that three damage might be the difference between life and death. Shoot the spore zombie! Okay, it's fine. I'll shoot him for you. <laughs> How? Tell me. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't punch the maggot. Shoot the pod man. Or miss the pod man. See, look, there's the milkshake Slurpees again. That sounds good. A milkshake Slurpee? Hmm. What am I saying? Alright, can you actually hit the thing when you shoot it? Thank you. Now, move away from Podman. He, he does not want. Oh, I should back up. Never mind. No, I have enough accuracy. <gasps> Wait a minute. Hang on. I know that was my bad, but 0% chance to hit? Was that just kicked by a pod person? Did it kick me? Dead. Yeah. <laughs> cool, now I just gotta chase down the bug and actually hit it with bullets. Nice. I mean, if it's any consolation, friend, he was a gross pod monster. Right? 
N not helping any, am I? Don't shoot the plant. Hit the plant. Oh, I think I remember. I have to pull it up. Yeah, I gotta throw a bomb on it. Or, like, do the stuff to make the plants die. <laughs> I mean, I'm not very good with the assault rifle, but I'm being given ammo, so I think that's what I should go with from now on. But, like, pistols in the really late game are very good. Like, dealing 70 damage, shot, and you can... It's just, I don't have any accuracy right now, because I, uh, bored my stats a little bit. I know it seems dumb to be gathering all the goofy plants, but I already kind of explained what that's all about. Oh, and I'm almost dead. Okay. Mm, me too. A little bit of first aid. <laughs> I... <laughs> I didn't use it on me. I used it on what's-his-face. Use... Use on yourself. It's the little things. It's the little things like that that are upsetting. Actually, why isn't Hawk tanking these plant pods? Actually, why isn't he tanking everything? Alright, I'm gonna go... Alright, I'm gonna go west next. See what's over there. Oh, more um, poison death, okay. I'm f that's fine. Just, can I hit the door? Jason, thank you, old door. Yay, medical supply. Uh, so, I guess these are a bunch of corpsey bodies. <laughs> Smells like a... S smells like soup from a swamp. <laughs> Some sort of skin infection, like a druid cast too many barb skins on him. The woman has a forest of herbs growing out of her skin, and I'm surprised nobody rolled her up and smoked her like a joint. Video game, come on. <laughs> you don't smoke people. <laughs> people aren't drugs. Drugs are drugs. Put that one. Put that one in the uh, the in the books. I guess that was just all information. Nothing special. Kick the door. Break your leg. Pick off the door. Please work. Please work. Please do. Dang it. Pick the door. Please. Place door. Come on now, place door. I have like everybody slowly dying of death poison. 
Why is, why is dying of death a thing I keep saying? Thank you. Oh, if his is that science at it. <laughs> Tell me its secrets. Uh, repair at it. Oh. Okay. Fine. I mean, I wish your leg wasn't all broken because of me telling you to kick that door, but... See, Hypel, problem with that is, um, no. <laughs> I'm here. I'm covered in pod goo. I don't know if I'll ever get on pod gooed. In fact, me and my men might even turn into pod goops. Pod goops. Pod men goop. Pretend these are words I'm saying. It's really hard to fill the void of silence with, like, cohesive thoughts when you're trying to think of them on the fly. I'm afraid our camera coverage is a lot spottier out there, so I won't be able to help as much. Good luck. You haven't been helping yet! Lots of experimental fruits and veg, not to mention a large rabbit population, so it's sure to be dangerous. Find the generator that's gone off the rails and find some way to get it back online. <laughs> Do not just blow it up. I know that comes naturally to meatheads like you, so try to restrain your... Yeah. Giant rabbit? A, a, a big rabbit problem or a big rabbit problem? Those are two very different things. I don't want you to put a tangerine in my head. Alright, I'm, uh, I'm just gonna skip this guy's thing, because he's basically like, there's rabbits doing stuff, and I would have to read his dialogue. Let me expand the, uh, that again. Let's do this, team. Come on, rabbit. Rabbit fight. <laughs> the attack animations are so wonky! You saw that, right? <sighs> she doesn't have any effect. How do you feel about punching rabbits? I know that it wasn't in the job description, but... Okay! <laughs> Wait a minute! That's man- that man's name! That man's name is Hunter Lewis, like, the Yogscast? Lewis and Simon? You know the people. I think they're referencing him. Oh, I should have read his dialogue, because he might have made Yogscast jokes. Damn. Oh well, no harm done, I guess. I'm just a little bit disappointed in myself is all. How did I not catch that when I started talking to him?
Is part of, like, the thing when you sign up to be a ranger, like, on your resume, do you have to put willing to hit rabbits? <laughs> Every time he shoots, I'm afraid he's gonna hit one of us. In fact, every time I shoot, I'm afraid I'm gonna hit one of us. She can't even hit them. Stop firing through me! It's terrifying, man! Okay, if, if you watch the animation, that club does hit the rabbit. Is it just immune to damage, like, 60% of the time? Is that what the numbers mean? Because I am not okay with this. So your newfound punching skills are gonna come into here. Ha! Ha da da! <laughs> I think... Alright, I, I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna... Well, no, Trix is already good with knives. I was gonna say, I could give the two female characters both boxing abilities, and they could do, like, mud wrestling? I don't know. Pretend that was less misogynistic. Alright, uh, I'm gonna pop a quick save, just in case some bad things happen. You can just kill those vines for me, please. Kill the vines. Hit door. Hit, hit door. Two words. Hit. Door. Actually, no, the heavy weapons don't have a weight limit, so... I could feasibly give that to, uh... People. And the door is locked and stuff. Science said it! Wait, no, 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 don't science! Stop sciencing! Hoo hoo! Disable the alarm that I can't do, so science it. Alright, I don't want to, I don't want to save scum, but there's literally no other way for me to open that door right now, unless there is. Like, that crumpled post-it note probably had something to do with it, but, uh, I'm not really going to bother with that, because that involves reading text. Actually, I'm out of time. I got, I got a little timer up, because uh, I need to, like, upload these in chunks, otherwise YouTube will be a little weird. So, uh, thanks everybody for watching. I'm pretty much going to pick up right from here, so I'll catch you next time.